Okay, I'm back. So now, uh, we're on the moon now, and we'll face Majora now. Can you run over here where we left him at? The other kids are back too, but we don't need to talk to them. Will you play with me? You have only weak, you have only weak match. So, you'll play? Oh, so I put on their mask now. And that's why I fight. Now this battle is when this mask is way overpowered in. I should have enough magic for this, but you never know. And this phase is the phase that makes it like makes it so, it's so much easier. This phase is so easy with this mask on. Because they're weak. Dora is weak everywhere. I can't remember if these masks go down to one or not. There's the first phase. Compare that to the one I played it without this mask. It's probably like a two or three minute difference, for sure. In this phase, it's easy anyway, so. <laughs> I mean, you don't even need the mask for this one. This is the first phase that makes it so much easier. Yeah, this is a little bit quicker. <laughs> Two seconds quicker. And she and now she's already on her last phase. how overpowered that mask is. <laughs> oh, gosh. The mask, even today, is just blows my mind as, like, just how overpowered it is. You can imagine if, like, you use this, like, the girl, like, if you were allowed to go outside of the boss room with this mask on. Oh, my gosh. Alright, well, I think that's gonna be the end of this bonus episode here. In short, the Fear Steve mask is way overpowered. It, it makes sense when they give it to you at the very, very, very end of the game. 100% everything. You really can't get much benefit out of it. Except just of being amazed by how powerful it is. So, uh, thank you guys for watching this, uh, bonus episode, and thank you for watching my LP. Uh, we'll probably start up a, sh a, sh a new one very shortly. So, uh, I will see you guys then as they cheer, cheer away the darkness.